Harold and the Purple Crayon. Crockett Johnson is very well known due to his comic strip Barnaby and the Harold book series. He was born on October 20th, 1906 in New York. Crockett's name originally was David Johnson Lysk. He later changed it to Crockett Johnson, which was his nickname in high school. He changed his name because it is hard to pronounce. After high school, Johnson went to college to study art. He had hundreds of paintings that were about science and art. Johnson was later married in 1943. He became an editor at many different McFran slash Hill publications. Johnson suffered lung cancer and passed away in 1975. Other books Crockett wrote include We Wonder What Walter Will Be When He Grows Up, The Blue Ribbon Puppies, and Harold at the North Pole. The suggested range for the book Harold and the Purple Crayon are ages 4 to 8 years old. It's intended for preschool through third grade. The book cover to cover is 64 pages and has a lexile measure of 440 L. Harold and the Purple Crayon is about a little boy that makes everything he wants. He lets his imagination run wild, as people say. Harold travels far and makes his way full of things he loves. Yes, this includes all nine different types of pies. This book is packed full of adventures that Harold and his Purple Crayon embark on. This book, I think, covers the topic of loneliness and depression. Harold never mentions friends or family. All of his adventures he is either by himself or draws animals to keep himself company. I personally think that there should be a note to the parent section to make a little warning. Although I don't think that third graders would think much into it or even have the mental capacity to look into the book that far. That is just my personal opinion. This book is rated very well on Amazon as other sites I looked at. People really enjoy the book itself, but mostly the bad reviews on Amazon are because of the condition the book comes in, such as ripped pages and bent covers. Some of the book reviews include, My kids loved this book because it really captured their imagination. Very easy for children and adults to read. Great length of book, about a 10 minute read, perfect for this age attention span. The only bad review was a mom that thought this book was creepy and that no young kids should read it. Other than that one lady, all the reviews for this book are mostly positive. When Harold almost fell, the book says, lucky he kept his wits and his purple crayon. I think this quote is very interesting as it is almost like this purple crayon is Harold's lifeline.